Okay, family, here's this message from the Holy Spirit of God. Remember to go to your prayer closets and ask for confirmation. Pray for discernment. And trust in no man or woman, but trust only in Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. I pray the blood of Jesus over this video and any and all who are led to listen to it. In Jesus Christ's most holy, holy, holy name. My brother, the Holy Spirit said, Look towards the east, the sea is moving. Look to the east, the earth will shake and the air will be filled with dust from the armies marching across the land. The wicked cannot sleep nor rest. They run riots, they run to riots and destruction. The blood of the innocent, they drink down as if it were wine. They are drunk from power. False apostles, false teachers, false ministers, drunk from the blood of my saints. I will turn their water into blood of dead men. It will be bitter water, not sweet wine of mine, grapes. I saw in vision a dark road, people running from a great famine. I looked on the road and a black horse and his rider, a famine was slaying men, women, and children, even those in the womb. I looked down this road and the red horse, his rider was war. He was ready to stir the nations to war in the houses, in the churches, in the field brother against brother, ready to kill one another. Parents and children, division. I looked down the road and saw the pale horse. His name, man of sin, son of perdition. He was given power over all the horsemen before them, for he was their king. Out of his mouth went a sword to devour the nations. I looked up and heaven was open wide and I saw a great light and I could hear the mighty rushing wind. I looked and behold my king, my Messiah, covered in light, his sword was dipped in blood, and all those upon the earth ran to hide themselves for fear of his sword. None could hide, all was revealed, and stood before his throne. I saw the scrolls in his hand, time had come to judge this world with those that have power of this, time had come to judge this world and those that have power of the red dragon. The falling away is here. Their eyes and mind has been blinded from hearing the truth. They are deceived, many are deceived into believing lies that are coming, preparing the way for the deceiver, the beast that is coming. The spirit of Antichrist has covered them with a veil, soon moving this world into the law of the new world order and the new world church. For even the devil knows Without the law, there is no sin. He will come to judge this world and call evil good and good evil. The sea rising is what is coming. We'll cover the sky. The sea is rising, my brother. What is coming will cover the sky, cover the sun. Many will be deceived into accepting this new age of man that is coming. Look to the heavens, my brethren, redemption is coming, like a fiery sword that will fall upon the heads of the wicked. The Holy Spirit spoke and said, warn them, call them to repentance, or I will cast them alive in the lake of fire with the beast of the ancients that has dwelt here since the beginning of time, hiding in dark places. Now it is their hour and they will soon be revealed to the world. Their technology is beyond mankind. The only one that can make war with them is Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior. The separation has begun. Chemical war here, chemical warfare is here in our nation. It is coming to Israel and to America. Soon, none will be able to speak against the New World Order or the New World Church. Those that do will be arrested. Darkness that covers this earth with blindness. Church, 
I pray that you guys all go into your prayer closets and pray with me against the times that are coming upon our land, against the darkness that is covering our land. Be a light. Be a beacon of light unto the lost so that the lost may find their way home. Fear not, for Jesus is with us. And if he is with us, who can be against us? He is our armor, our shield and our buckler. He has our back. Stand with me and proclaim that he has already won victory. He won this victory at the cross. He has given us everything we need and has prepared us for this time. Every hardship we have had to endure Every evil that has come our way has prepared us for what is coming. As we will stand in faith and proclaim his victory in Jesus Christ's most holy, holy name. God bless you all, my brothers and sisters. When the things start coming upon this earth and the great shaking has begun, when things happen, remember to help those who are you able to. He will send some your way, and those are the ones who will be ready to now listen to his word. He has equipped us and will not give us more than we can handle. Glory to God in the highest. Amen and amen. God bless you all.